So here I'm forging the uh, point to start the knife. Uh, you'll notice I'm rotating 90 degrees. Uh, beginners may find it easier to rotate 180 degrees. You might get a better point that way. Uh, this is using the edge of the anvil to draw the stock. It's a very aggressive technique that utilizes a rounded edge in order to really thin material down. You're not trying to make a, a whole lot of deep gouges here. You're, you're using the corner of the anvil as if it is the anvil. Also, you'll notice here that I do the whole length and I come back and do half the length and then come back and do half of what's left or a quarter of the length. Uh, a little easier to to get a quick taper, distal taper that way. Um, you can see also now that I'm forging on the anvil that uh, didn't create a lot of deep gouges. You want to avoid that because those could lead to cold shuts on the surface of your steel. Now here I'm just setting the curve to begin the bevel. And in this uh, shot, it, it's sort of tricky. It looks as though I'm pretty far back from the edge, but in fact the edge of this anvil is very rounded. The step there is extremely rounded. Um, it's almost about a um, about a five eighths of an inch radius. You can tell by the light playing off the the um, step there that it's a, that it's a very very broad curve. So I'm actually right at the edge of the anvil. Uh, that's for hammer clearance. You don't want your hammer to contact the face of the anvil. So that's the point of this video, is to, is to be out to the edge. Here I'm not actually tapering, I'm just straightening the knife. You obviously can straighten on the, on the face of the anvil. I hope that helps.